Good afternoon, everybody. This is Mel with m and Archery here in Kentucky. Uh, we're going to do a little review of the Obsession Bowline. Now, Obsession is new to our company here at m and uh, We added it this year uh, after the ATA show. I got to spend some time with the people in the booth there and really enjoyed the way the quality uh, was set on these uh, bows. Uh, the staff was very helpful, and plus they got the pig man this year shooting it, so that's their professional archer that they're using. Um, so he's promoting it really well. Uh, the bow that I chose to uh, bring into the shop that I'm going to be uh, reviewing today is called the Obsession Turmoil RZ. So you can kind of see it. This is the mossy oak bottomland um, pattern. So it's the pattern from a long time ago that was in the original um, clothing of your hunting patterns if you've ever seen that type. Uh, done. The cam system is pretty unique on it. It is uh, something they call an RZ cam and it has a rotating module so you can change your draw length. So what I like about this is you can change this draw length if uh, you measure yourself to being like a 28 and a half or 29 and it just doesn't seem quite um, enough or doesn't feel right. You can change this to uh, fit you more properly. Uh, this bow is fast uh, even with a rotating uh, module system which is kind of unique to it because I haven't seen a bow that has uh, a bow speed of 350 feet per second. So it is light, uh, holds and balances really well. You can kind of see it has a six and a half inch brace height here. Um, so it's kind of just under that seven inch that everybody always gripes about wanting in a hunting bow. Um, but it's right over that six inch so it produces that great speed. Another good factor about this uh, Obsession bows is they come in 50, 60, 65, and 70 pounds uh, limb system. This one, when I measured it, came in right around probably 64 is what I measured it uh, on my bow scale. Uh, it does come with the dampeners. Uh, you can kind of see the quality of uh, the limb pockets that they have right here. So it's really stout and sturdy. It doesn't allow kind of any twisting or torquing on it. Uh, you do have a single Y cable on here uh, with your control cable, um, but then you have your three sp uh, speed beats. So there's a lot of different patterns that you can get on the Obsession bowline simply by going on their site. You can choose so many different things on it. Um, but what really I liked about this bow is the way it, uh, way it feels in my hand when I shoot. There's very little shock. It is quiet, so it's a really good hunting bow if you're looking in that. Uh, and it comes in our price right under $700. So you can kind of see how you have that. Now I put a whisker biscuit on it today. Um, they've got sort of like this area here where you can see their, their cable slide kind of goes at an angle. I guess it quietens the bow down a little bit, but it just feels so good with the string stop. So I'm gonna shoot a little bit. This is a 28 and a half inch draw. It's a little shorter for my draw length that I have, but kind of pay attention to how, how quiet the bow is. So it would be perfect for you uh, if you're hunting or any kind of hunting applications uh, that you're going to do. So I'll get my knock up and kind of see how it, it balances and holds. I open my hand, it kind of just balances so well. Most bows want to fall forward, it's not like that with this one. Uh, the axle on this one, uh, when I look at it, um, it is 33, uh, a little over 33 inches axle to axle. Uh, not too long for the tree stand. Uh, but also not short for the tree stand, so uh, it would be perfect for any kind of hunting applications. So pay attention to the way the cams roll over. You can kind of see it, and it is a rock solid back wall, so there's no play or anything in it. So we're going to take our first shot, holds well, it's an 80% let off on the draw length. First shot, not bad. We're going to try to do another. We're going to set. The grip feels really good. It's a thinner type grip with the wood panels. So you can kind of see how they are right there. Um, it's not too thick. If you don't like a big, thick grip on it, uh, it's perfect for any kind of uh, shooting that you want to do. So you could very easily shoot 3D tournaments with this bow if you wanted to. On the weekends and then through the week or weekends you can hunt with it so it's I call it a dual purpose bow nice and quiet on the draw points really well kind of see how it collapses even more on the draw
nice and solid, can't pull anymore. Shoots very well. So again, this is Mel with Eminem Archery, uh, reviewing the Obsession Terminal RZ. Uh, so if you're in the market for a new bow or want to come in and try one out, stop in and see us here at Eminem Archery. Thank you, and shoot straight.